Hello, 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 beautiful people. It is your girl, Javicia, and I am back with another video. So today is day 15 of Vlogtober. Yes, y'all have been rocking with me for 15 days. 15 days of content each and every day, y'all. Can we take a second to acknowledge the fact that I have posted 15 videos in 15 days? Y'all, that is wild to me. That is amazing. Okay, so first of all, YouTube is something that I have wanted to do for a extremely long amount of time, ever since I was a little girl, but I cared way too much what people thought and it has been a distant dream. Like I just decided that I would never do it. You know, I would create videos and then delete them. I just never kept them up because I was so scared. But this year I said, that's it, it's a wrap. I'm getting out of my own way and I'm posting content and it has been it has been a wild ride ever since then. And I had some hair brain scheme. Is that how you say it? Hair brain scheme? We gonna go with it. I decided I had this wild idea to do Vlogtober and I said, you know what? I'm gonna do it. I really am. I didn't know how I was gonna do it, but I made that decision and I have kept up with it for 15 days. I am so proud of myself. I still have 15, no, 16 days to go, but I think we can do this. And the whole goal of Vlogtober, because I am in the process of trying to build my community here on YouTube, I really wanted to find ways to, and that's my dog in the background, y'all, I apologize. So I really wanted to create content where you guys could get to know me better, whether it be through Q&As, whether it be from um, introducing you guys to my grandmother, talking about my goals, my financial goals, letting you guys know some of the hair products and wigs that I like to use. Like I have been trying to bring you guys content that introduces you to different aspects of my life. Hope you guys have enjoyed this journey as much as I have enjoyed creating this content for you. So I just wanted to take time to just acknowledge what we've done to the, together we have really started building a community and I'm, it's one that i'm really proud of so thank you for being a part of it and if you haven't already subscribed what are you waiting for join this community we have so much more content coming like i told you guys i have 16 more videos coming your way if you guys have any ideas on more content that you guys want to see please leave it in the comment section below i just wanted to share with you guys some things that i have learned on this journey to get in this vlogtober done um one thing i have learned is the power and batch processing so i definitely spend a lot of time coming up with ideas concepts that i want to record but then i start thinking about ways that i can batch process so i think of which videos i can record all at the same time so that i can get them done created and then spend a bulk of time just editing them and getting them ready to post if i really focus on one video at a time meaning recording editing posting it then recording editing and posting another one i would never get through this so i definitely have found the beauty in batch processing so i will take i want to say five or six video ideas that make sense together and i will write them out figure out you know the figure out what i want to say the concepts of them write them all out write the outline out and then i'll get myself together find outfits that I want to wear and I'll record all five of them at the same time. Then I'll take those five videos, those raw, that raw footage, I'll sit and I'll batch edit those videos and have them ready to go. I usually will set them up to, um, I'll schedule them and set them up to be, to, to be pushed out. So when you guys are seeing content, it's probably been recorded, edited, and scheduled a week prior. When I started Vlogtober, let's say October 1st, I already had nine videos that were recorded, edited, and scheduled to post by October 1st. So it has definitely been um, a process for me to learn how to be as efficient as possible. And it's been a learning curve, that's for sure. But I will say that by batch editing and batch posting, it gives me wiggle room. My aunt had 
some health issues, a health scare that took up about a, a week of my time and I wasn't able to edit, record, do much of anything. But I already had those videos up and ready to go so I wasn't stressed out about it and it gave me more time to get my life together, my private life together so that I could come back ready to go for you guys. So batch editing has become a best friend of mine. Also, I've learned this time around to be very quiet about my goals. I have a small group of people that have been my support system through this. I want to say thank you. Thank you. Thank you for supporting me. Kim, thank you. You watch my videos more than I do. I really appreciate you and your daughter for being a subscriber and constantly thinking of bigger and better ways for me to grow this channel. Rencha, you have been an amazing source of feedback and just being there with me each and every week as we make our dreams happen. It has been a beautiful experience with you, so thank you. My sister, I love you. She watches my content. She will send me messages. She gives me words of encouragement, and I think out of anybody, her sending me messages and just saying, yo, I'm proud of you, or I liked this video, or I didn't like that video has been feed in my spirit so thank you Tade I love you Dennis thank you for having that initial conversation with me about lighting because you have been a game changer definitely not you know top tier but I am a lot better than that first video that I posted in my in this room here so thank you for being willing to have a conversation with me and willing to share some words of encouragement and thank you to y'all for watching these videos because with you without you guys i wouldn't have a community so thank you for that as well wifey i want to say thank you for watching my videos subscribing sharing them it's just i really enjoy the support it's free you know people just want to you know shout you out when it benefits them and right now you know i'm a small youtuber i don't have a large following i'm really paying attention to those people that breathe life into me and i just want to say thank you to my tribe ramona thank you for always being the voice of reason thank you for listening to me complain thank you for watching videos and letting me know what you think and just breathing life into me because i am my own worst critic so i appreciate the positivity and the honesty y'all my tribe has been so dope and i just wanted to say thank you granny also thank you for recording the q a's because i know I know you did not want to do that, but you did it because I asked and I will love you forever for that. <sighs> Didn't think that this video would be thank yous, but I'm in the spirit of gratitude right now. This is has been an amazing journey and it's only halfway done. So yeah, I just wanted to say thank you to the people that had been rocking with me. And if I forgot anybody, please don't charge it to my heart. I apologize if I did forget to name you. It has been amazing to see me push myself in terms of creativity. I try to get 1% better each time I post something, whether it be with the recording, whether it be with the editing, whether it be with the post-production of the piece of content. I want to get better each and every time I do something and pushing myself and learning new editing techniques and learning new filming techniques has been an interesting journey, but it's been really rewarding. So I'm very excited to see you know where this takes me but last but not least y'all i'm tired i'm a little tired this has been this takes a lot out of me and um but it's been fun nonetheless it really has been and i i wouldn't change anything i would definitely do this time and time again in fact i am playing around with the idea of doing um vlogmas which is december 1st through the 25th posting content as well so if you're interested in that Leave me a comment in the comment section below. Would love to hear feedback on it. I am so grateful to be here with you guys and I am looking forward to the remaining 16 videos to come. So I will see you guys in the next video. I just wanted to touch base, have a moment to just talk to you guys um, and come from the heart, you know? That's all. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.